Hey darlings, good morning you saucy little sausages. If you're watching this in the afternoon, afternoon. Right guys, I know I've been very quiet, I've been purposely quiet at the minute because new dad, check that out, you know, got an eight month old little Austin boy, you're gonna see him in this video and you know for a fact I ain't sleeping. I'm there like, <laughs> yay, close eyes, ah, frick. Almost went lesser PG there. So guys, I let you blow up my feed on Instagram, I let you blow up my feed on Twitter. I asked for some more intriguing questions and then uh, you guys kind of, you gave me that. Thank you very, thank you. If you're new to the channel, I apologize for the teddy bears in the background, they're not mine. <laughs> they're, they're mine. This one's fluffy. If he was a bit more black around him he'd be a penguin and I'd hate him and I'd throw him and I hate you right so guys let's dive straight into this I'm gonna grab Austin and let's do this it's gonna be fun I like these videos it was good to be back on camera what the hell is ro I know I always make jokes about my hair being a pineapple but today it l genuinely looks like a banana split or like like a sw it looks like someone has put whipped cream on my head you know, swelled it right. My, my hair looks like a foot. No, not a foot, that's, that's a lot. Just question myself. Like, a lot of people look at me sometimes, and they're like, what the hell is wrong with your hair? Imagine how I feel every time I wake up and I do it, I'm just there like, why? So Austin's joining us for this video, wow! Look how big he is! Say hello. <gasps> Shall I eat my child now? Say hello! <laughs> you're gonna be a crazy little person. You're gonna you're gonna be the campest child ever, aren't you? <laughs> Look at him. Right, so let's dive straight into it. Austin, you gonna read the questions. What is your inspiration? This little monkey. This little monkey is my inspiration. The guy that looks terrified right now in video. Do you want do you want a do you want a toy to play with? Do you, want to talk, do, you want to, do you want an awkward teddy bear with a weird shape? Here you go. Enjoy. You between my arms. Why did you start making music and why is Austin called Austin? Austin is called Austin for many reasons. Um, and I started making music because I was seeing a girl. No, no. I, I started making music because of School of Rock. Deniers. The film School of Rock. I started making music because of School of Rock. And I also... Uh, just really enjoyed writing music, so I started doing that in London uh, because I was seeing a lady in London, which is actually this little man's baby mama. Yeah, been, that's been a long time, hasn't it? Been a long time. So yeah, uh, that's why I started making music. Austin's called Austin because uh, one of Lucy and my favorite bands are called Of Mice and Men. The guy, the singer that's left now because of health reasons called Austin Carlisle. We saw them just before they broke up. And Austin, I think it's quite common in America, but not that common in England. And when you say it in it, Ameri like American accent, it's like Austin. But when you say, <laughs> don't like that. But when you say it in English, like Austin. It's cute. Yay. <laughs> Have you ever thought of having another child? We're gonna make so many of you. It's gonna be creepy. There's gonna be so many Austins. There's gonna be so many. <laughs> this is not child abuse. He normally laughs. <laughs> How old is your son? My son is eight months old. Eight months old currently. And he's a whopping 21, 22 pounds. He's a large baby. He likes his mommy's milk. It's the weirdest thing I've ever said on camera. Right. <laughs> what was the most embarrassing moment of your life? Um, Really? Well, I went to leave for a gig the other day and I feel like uh, this one should replace. Yes, it's about you. Um, as I went to go out, I was all dressed ready, nice bright, not bright, but you know like denim jeans on. I had like nice bright blue jeans, uh, just strolling out, making myself all happy. Um, I hold Luke Austin just before he goes in the bath and he takes a giant crappy poo down my leg. And um, yes, correct, you did that. You little bugger, you pooed all down my bloody nice jeans. So yeah, embarrassing. What was one thing you wish you did as a teenager that you regret not doing? Um, I always wanted to be a, a police officer, um, just so I could go around beating up people. No, I'm joking. I always wanted to be, yeah, some, something like that, like a police officer, like fireman, some stuff, something stupid, something that's far more manly than I am. <laughs> 
<laughs> I have like zero metal up there, you silly sausage. This poor boy is gonna be the least manly man. No, I hope, I reckon he'll be quite manly. He says as he eats his really feminine toddy. Good boy. But yeah, so basically something more manly than I am. Have you ever been mistaken for someone else? Never before in my life. I never get compared to anyone else, especially not other YouTubers. Especially not people that play freaking Minecraft. Especially not that. How does it feel reminiscing over everything you've achieved over the past few years? Do you know what? Um, it's, it's, it, ooh, ah! it's a weird one because I feel like I'm almost, I've waste, I'm wasting what a lot of people would love to do so much. But if it makes sense to you, like I'm not, I'm not out there to be an artist. Like I've never, I've been a songwriter first and then that, having this little man has changed my priorities so much. He's like, yeah, you better. But it's just incredible to know the amount of people that supported, the amount of people that supported the anti-bullying campaign, the amount of like artists I got to support, work with, the amount of people that paid to come see me in show, like forgot, they, pay, they, they paid money to stare at this for like two hours. I just, I'm, Genuinely humbled, sarcasm aside, like, yeah, it makes me feel very proud, but also for sometimes I'm wasting because a lot of people would kill to do it, you know? What's your vocal range naturally? It's, it's hard. I can do, I fell into a burning ring of fire to like, um, yeah, quite high like that, but I'm also like, I need you, darling, come on, set the tone. I can get quite a, did you drop your teddy? But then the best one, wind the bobbin up, wind the bobbin up, pull, pull, clap, he likes that one. Ah, statement covering 30 seconds to Mars, the kill of Peaky Blinders totally, uh, totally made my night. Loving the CD, by the way, Who Cuts Your Hair? Um, it's a lady called Natasha Lawrence, she's fabulous. Uh, she makes my, my hair look <coughs> terrible. Thanks, Austin. If you don't speak baby, that means terrible. Am I your friend? Logan, you are my bae, mate. I freaking love you. Creepy way. Cre creepy style. I will eat you one day. What would Austin have been called if he was a girl? I mean, you've probably already answered it. Um, yeah, Luna. Luna. Luna Catal! Because I love the name Luna. It's friggin' fabulous. If you could revisit one time in your life, when would it be and why? Uh, Newcastle 02. That gig was insane. All the people and the people bringing whisks, thinking they were whisks, but they were head massages for whisking away the working day. Friggin' unreal. And um, the smell backstage smelled like someone had died and pooed themselves at the same time. So I will never forget it because of the poo smell. And let's be honest, being a dad now, all I can smell is poo all the time. Yay! What do you think of the Logan Paul situation? I've never been suicidal. I'm definitely not the kind of person to talk about this. I feel like everybody's clickbaited the hell out of it. I think what he did was completely irresponsible, unforgivable in that respect. In the respect, But unforgivable, I don't think his career should end for it. I know he made mistakes, he should donate. I don't like how he's come back out and just gone from the really good, like I'm gonna donate money and then just kind of ridiculously just come back out and instantly plug the merch again. I think it's kind of, I get being a maverick. I, but, it just, it doesn't make sense to me. Um, you know, so you can tell by Austin's face right now, it'll make sense to him. Long story short, don't think it's Chris then, fair play, but it was a pretty, a pretty crap thing to do, you know what I mean? Um, yeah, I agree. Would you ever come back to Scunthorpe and do another sh- <laughs> Yeah, I travel all the time. Get your schools to get in touch. Maybe even bring the baby and he can stare at you like he is right now. He's staring into your soul. We're on the vlog cam, so he's looking at himself, the little vein bugger. Say, hello, Austin. <laughs> Say, hello, Austin. <laughs> Final one. Can you make a video of you rapping as fast as you can? I just... Oh, sorry. I just ended world hunger in a rap. Friggin' love that. Right. Oh, baby, you just gotta love yourself. Shelby asked, what was your first reaction to Austin being born? I passed out. We were both knackered. Um, he had taken two hours of pushing to get out because he's a big boy and Lucy's only a small girl and oh my god when he came out he was just unreal like oh he's a bit swollen so he didn't look I thought oh my god he's a little bit of a chunky baby like you know like uh, uh, I'm gonna be honest with you Austin I thought you were a bit of an ugly baby because your face was a bit swollen like tell daddy off you know but then the next day when I saw him I was like oh my god 
you are heaven. <coughs> yeah, you're heaven. Mm -hmm. Very lucky. Guys, thank you so much for the questions. Thank you so much for the continued support. If you check out the link below for those shirts, a lot of people have been asking me about the shirts. They've been reduced to £10. There's only one size of them left, Youth XL. That fits me. They're not tiny. They're not tiny. <coughs> Oh, sugar, sugar, sugar. If you do want to get one, really appreciate it. They're £10. It just covers the PayPal fee from the website and also you know, shipping. And then like a tiny bit to cover the cost of the shirt. If you wanted them, we're getting rid of them because we're going to be doing new merch. Austin wants one. We're going to do a little Austin baby go. But guys, have a freaking legend time. A legend day. I'll see you very, very soon. And um, big love from me and Austin. Go on. Go and kiss the camera. Kiss it. Kiss the camera. Do you love the camera? Do you love the audience? Do you want to eat them, beat them up and poo on them? Yeah, you do. Look at that creepy face. Bye, my lovers. Woo!